Hi guys, <laughs> excuse my appearance today, I feel like something that fell out of the bin. I feel like I've been just saying that all the time because I'm like still unpacking in this house and trying to get everything organised. I'm currently in my new office space which is full of clothes at the moment and just a little bit messy but we'll get there. I just want to apologise for the delay in a lot of these vlogs going up. I'm getting through so many vlogs this week. I have been editing like a crazy person so I'm so excited to kind of get them all bashed out to you guys. I don't need to kind of reiterate what I said in my last vlog but, or my last like update video but I am just going to do it for the purpose of this one in case you didn't see it. There's just been a lot going on in my life. <laughs> Moving into a new house, my job, obviously Noah, main priority. I just want to say thank you so much to everybody who's sticking around, everybody who's continuously watching and is enjoying these vlogs, even if they are very delayed and late and going up. I have so many to edit, like I literally have, I'd say about six or seven vlogs on the back burner where I have been vlogging but just didn't get time to edit. We're moving in and looking after Noah and when he was sick and in the hospital and everything. So we're finally catching up with everything. I just want to say thank you so much to all you guys who've been hanging in tight, who've been waiting for these vlogs and for who've been like writing to me on Instagram and contacting me and just saying that you really enjoy the content. I really appreciate it and I, I'm so sorry that I suck at YouTube at the moment. I I have no excuses other than like just life in general but I'm I really 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 I'm appreciative of all of you guys who have stuck around and I'm sorry that I've been incredibly frustrated frustrating to watch because I hate watching someone who's inconsistent I lose interest in them so for all you guys who have been sticking with me like I really appreciate it so yeah I'm gonna stop labbing on you can watch this vlog and enjoy it and I will have more this week fingers crossed because I have a few of them edited and ready to go because they are house updates they haven't been done over like a day or two they've been done over a couple of weeks I hope to have all those whatever it is like seven eight vlogs up this month and I really appreciate you guys so much I cannot stress that enough thank you so much for watching and thank you for always been here and I'm sorry for always saying that in nearly every single vlog lately I love you from the bottom of my heart and just enjoy this vlog for what it is even though it's a little bit old guys, and welcome back to the vlog we were at a housewarming. We were at Paddy's twins' housewarming. We had such a lovely night. We said that we would go and do some house hunting for things for like our bathrooms, just the house in general, like a few bits and pieces. We obviously are not going to get too much because there's a lot of rooms not finished and not done. So we just said well, we do it whatever we can today. So we're at Nashburn going to Choice and Yisk. Yisk, I think I'm saying that right. And then there was a thing I was looking for in Argus and it's been out of stock and I don't think I'm gonna get that either. But we're gonna just have a little look around. Then we're gonna go to Ikea. I'm going in here to look at homeware, the retail park. Um, and it's actually so funny because Rock Dock's right there. That's where Damien used to work, but we're um, recommended it. So we said we go in and have a look. Our interior is going to be like doing the bathrooms for each room. Oh yeah, it is. <laughs> Together. You mm. it's, you're picking a lamp here. You're picking piles and you're going to fit it in. Oh, like photo frames and stuff. Spraying a can paint. I actually need some of this. I need like a brush brass one for our toilet. Um, they don't have anyone here that I need. Yeah, our toilet has brush brass features in the bathroom, as you know. But the push button on the toilet, we couldn't get brush brass, they just don't do it anywhere. So I need to get spray paint and actually spray it on. A dust pan and brush, we should get one of them for Noah. <laughs> Noah's obsessed with them. Some work in the house, do we? Who explained to Was it to Simon? And something about my dog. What, you want me to put all my stuff in that? 40 quid for the attic. What, you need a few of them, I imagine. They were only a tenner. No. Yeah, they're 10 euro. This is 10 euro. Oh. This is 40 quid. Or, yeah, two for, where are you seeing 40 euro? Oh, two for 20. Two for fifty. Okay. Where? Ah. This is so much stuff in here. That's a lot of cleaning things. 
definitely things we don't need right now. We need more appliances. Or accessories for our bathroom. These are really nice. Tupperware boxes. We might get a little lunchbox for Noah here. That's a good idea. Yay. They have really nice bits and pieces in here. Knives. My favourite thing. <laughs> you got a lunchbox for Noah? Great. Oh no, these are way cuter. Look, a little lunchbox. Uh, is there a small one? Yeah, there's some down here. It has to fit in the bag, even like these little That's small perfect. ones. Yay, they're so cute. One or two. Literally everything in here. And the little coffee machines, and the hand blender. I like this, put in a black. I picked up the black one, I think. I might get that. That's the gray one up there. I picked up the black one, I think is nice. So much choice of things. What about kettles? I think we're a bit premature getting kettles, yeah. We could probably go with grey and brass. Maybe we get some cinnamon if you put Well, we don't really know until the kitchen's done. Maybe get that black. I think this is really yeah. nice. I like that one. So nice. A little eucalyptus plant. Mum bought me a real one and uh, I don't think she's doing too well. So I think I'll have to stick with fake plants. <laughs> this is nice, like as a fruit bowl or something. Or I suppose for anything you kind of wanted, decorative things. So many nice bits in here. I obviously want to go crazy and go shopping and buy everything. But I just realised we don't have like... Obviously the house is a little bit of like a building site at the moment, so I don't want to like buy things that we don't need or don't have room for, or then have to try and store. Um, so we're just gonna kind of get bits as we need them. And then as rooms are finished, like the bathrooms are getting finished now, so we can start getting the accessory bits for them. Then when the kitchen's done, we'll start like stocking up the kitchen. Um, but yeah, in here, I'm just tempted to buy everything, <laughs> but I have to hold that. Going into these. Scandinavian sleeping and living. The shed is to the side. Of the house. Well, this place is nice. There's oh, nice things in here too. The only thing we I got nice place mats with this and pennies. They're nice. Okay. Yeah. The little trolley that you get in IKEA that everyone has. And these baskets are nice as well. You want loads of cushions on our L shaped couch like that. You <laughs> sleep in this. <laughs> Come on, Sleeping. Yeah, it is actually really nice. You'd have this. And then trolls. She may as well just make a bed out of it. Never <laughs> really curl up on my bed. Yeah. Just imagine that, but just down. Such nice things in here. Yes, yes, this type of stuff, yes. <laughs> comfort, pure comfort. Mm. You're not one, sorry. Oh, These are nice. nice. Loads and bath towels and they're all in like promotion special offers. And there are loads of like accessories for your bathroom, for home. This place is amazing. It's really, really nice and garden stuff as well. Pots. I really like this store. They just again <laughs> have a lot of like bathroom stuff that we just can't get yet because our bathrooms aren't finished. But we can get a toilet roll, 
toilet roll, <laughs> a brush cleaner for the toilet. So that's what I'm picking up. Everything else will just have to wait until our plumber is completely and utterly finished. But I'll be coming back here like next week probably because I think the bathrooms will be finished on Friday. So I just don't know what I want in the bathroom. I should have made like a mental note. But like this place is so cool. Anyway, we have one. our squeegee. No, I want to get a full black one. A full black squeegee, <laughs> and we have our. It might be something for these. Our toilet brush, so that's fun. They have beds up here as well. Mattresses. This place is huge. More of Paddy's storage bins. He's obsessed with them. <laughs> Hangers and office spaces. Oh, this is a bit of you now, all this dark stuff. Well, like, obviously I like it, but I don't, I, mean, I have no idea where the hell it would go. Yeah, just buy it anyway. <laughs> yeah. I'm just going to have to wait till we slowly start populating the house, and then I can see where I want all the stuff. They have curtains blinds, and everything. Cur oh, I haven't even given blinds or curtains a second thought at the moment. We're just in Ikea now, just gonna have like a really quick look for the bits that we want and I don't even think we're gonna go do the big tour around, I think we're just gonna go downstairs and get what we need, get in, get out and yeah, that's basically it. Every single time I vlog you're like so cut off because we're really tough. We look, we look dishevelled today. clear vision of things that we needed to get in here like one or two items on our basket is like getting fuller and fuller as we go around but there's so many nice new things in here that I haven't seen in like before and I'm kind of tempted by them all there's loads of storage containers which we need and we've talked about that already but we really actually need to start getting them because our attic is being floored at the moment so we need to start putting the containers up there uh, while the ceiling's been plastered so we need to pick some of them up very 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 soon so I might pick up some today I really like them here this is so cute it's only 29 euro it's really nice I like these kind of like wicker lamps they're very 1970s all the different lights I love them, they're so nice, exposed lights. Yeah, I think that's nice for our family room slash Paddy's office. No, I'll be able to find it again. That's actually a really nice picture frame. So we just got a few bits for the bathroom, nothing very exciting, had to pick up the dimes, why not? Yeah, I think we got what we wanted, we didn't really intend on coming in here for as long as we did, but we did. Just come to visit our house and dad has managed to paint the ceiling, so excited and we'll see what kind of differences have happened since the last we were here. What is going on in here? Oh, Noah's big turtle. That's a birthday gift from his nanny and granddad, Paddy's parents. 
and all in here. Oh, and dad's put this down because the plaster is coming next week to do the ceiling here. And then I don't know if you've seen the floor in here, but uh, this is very exciting. So this is down ready for our new floors. We have our new radiator under here. Our skirting has to go on and we have the attic insulated. So this room is coming together quite nicely. So my daddy is here doing the ceiling here, preparing that. So he's gotten all of this done and down here. And yeah, it's all ready for plastering. And here's our new bathroom. Oh, the plumber moved the toilet. The toilet wasn't perfectly centered and my brain was just not able to cope with that. So this is what our bathroom is looking like. Here's our new shower all in. I know the chrome and the brush, brush brass, it was annoying me initially, but it actually doesn't really bother me that much. I might spray these. I think you can take these off. You probably can. The handles and spray it, but it honestly doesn't bother me. The shower's huge. This is our new bath and the toilet, which he's obviously going to be fixing back to the wall because he moved it out a little bit. And then this is our sink unit with the doors on and everything. It looks so pretty. Also, this is another thing that really annoyed me, but it doesn't, it's not that bad now, but it was just like the fact that this jutted out just ever so slightly. And yeah, I was just kind of like hating the aesthetic of it, but I think everything looks really great now. The toilet is out a bit far, obviously into the middle of the room, but it looks good because he wanted to give us a lot more room beside the bath. And I actually don't really mind the fact that there's not that much room beside the bath. I prefer a little bit more space this side. Um, yeah, and like I thought this was gonna be really narrow. It looks kind of tight there, but it's actually not. Now this unit is quite big and in hindsight, I would have preferred it just a teeny bit smaller, but it is what it is right now. And you know, you live and you learn, but I think the bathroom looks superb, especially the the tiling and everything just looks really, really good. This is our ensuite, which I'll turn on the light so you can see it. It looks so good. So I'll just move that back and you can see it all in its full glory. It needs to be cleaned. It's quite dusty uh, still because of obviously the work going on, but this is the unit in here and the toilet again i was worried about this like gap here but it's actually perfect it looks a lot narrower on camera but it's actually quite big and then this is the shower noah's giving out and we got our big round mirror and the uh, radiator with all the other fixtures on it again another thing that i wasn't sure if i was gonna like it when it was in the box was this just because it's like that marble effect but I actually love it now and I love the long handles I just think that the ensuite is like a completely different room obviously but it is gorgeous this is some of the bits we got on Ikea just for the bathroom so we got a shower or a bath mat and and we got the see oh yeah what are you doing now you're trying to get the water you're trying to get it. <laughs> also, when I was editing this video, I realized I didn't do an outro. So this is the outro. Thank you again for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. And like I said, more consistency is hopefully the way we're going to be going in the future. Um, Because I, I really am disappointed in myself that I just can't be more consistent. It's not out of boredom for YouTube or anything like that. It's literal time and trying to find it. It's just impossible at the moment. But I really do appreciate you guys. I appreciate you watching. And I appreciate you being here. I appreciate your comments. I appreciate everything. And we will get back at it at some stage. Like life is getting a lot easier now that we've moved in and everything. So yeah. I love you guys so much. Thank you again for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.